Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, we are going to be going over the Vintage EQ in Ozone 8, which is right here, and this emulates the Poltec style of EQs. This is a, a very old unit. Uh, it's about 60 years old, and basically, it's the, the difference between like a conventional, well, like an equalizer you'll run across a lot in the digital world. It's a little bit different. So there's set frequencies. So these numbers are like. 5,000 hertz, 8,000 hertz, and you boost kind of accordingly. The the boost and the uh, Q changes uh, depending on the boost, and uh, these particular frequencies were chosen uh, because that's just kind of what you wanted to adjust back then to kind of adjust the tonal balance of the whole thing. Uh, I could get into that. It's uh, more of a console-style EQ way of working. But, um, and I think I went over this in my last kind of tutorial series, the special part about the Vintage EQ is its effect on the low end. So basically, what made the units kind of famous, and this is true with a lot of things, using things in a way that they're not meant to be used, you could either boost or cut the low end, and you can... Ha you can adjust those at the same time, uh, the manufacturer and the the uh, the the manual said don't do this, but people kind of did anyway, and you can simultaneously boost and cut at the same time. So when you boost, it's a kind of a an analog style shelf, and then it kind of boosts up that way, so it's a really interesting curve. You notice around this area, it kind of changes the curve, and that's uh, typical of analog gear. And the uh, low cut here is kind of the same deal. So if you use both of these at the same time, you boost and then you have a little bit of a dip. And if someone's been, you know, if you've been watching my videos for quite some time, I usually do this on the low end. Um, and that's just how I, how I was raised. Uh, and this kind of adds an exceptional kind of low end feel to it, which I'll uh, demonstrate right now. That's a little bit exaggerated, and there's a lot of low end here already, but this is a way to uh, really adjust the low end. You see, notice what it does? Pretty cool. It adds like an interesting kind of uh, shelf, and if that looks familiar, the same one is in here, resonant. Right, that one right there, kind of boost and then cut at the same time, same dealio, right? But, you know, a little bit more analog looking, I guess. That's how you want to describe it. Um, and this is a way to add, you know, um, warmness, I guess, from uh, cutting and stuff like that. You can boost particular frequencies and uh, add a bit of warmness, kind of accentuate things in uh, the old school way. So with that being said, that's uh, the uh, vintage EQ. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned stuff. Take care and have a good one.